Hello everyone, I hope everyone is doing well. Today we are going to see an on-campus placement that is HCL Tech. It is an on-campus placement for 2025 batch women students and the LPA is 4.25. Okay, in this video we are going to see the process and the hiring and the qualifications should be required. And before that, if you are new to the channel, please do subscribe, share and like my videos. If already a subscriber, please hit a like so that it motivates me to do more and more videos for you. Right, let us going into the video. And the eligibility is for BTEC and BE students. And the coming to the branches, CSC, IT, Triple E and EC students are eligible to take this exam. Only for women students and that to 2025 batch. And the details are details about graduate engineer trainee GET program that is designation is graduate engineer trainee and the LPA is 4.25 service agreement is 12 months about RAS of 50k uh, and location is Pan India you are allowed in any place in the India okay and coming to the note points applicant should have an ob obtained greater than or equal to 70 percentage throughout academics 10th 12th and graduation until the last semester so here you are going to see the importance of cgpa you have to maintain cgpa of uh, 70 percentage or above in order to uh, eligible to this uh, on campus placement written exam okay applicant should not have any semester or term backlog or a year backlogging in btech be CSE, IET, Triple E, ECE, EIE at, uh, at the time of applying. Candidates need to complete the registration process on the given link. Incomplete applications will not be considered for further process. Pre-joining training if applicable will be triggered to the students or internship prior to the joining. The same needs to be com completed and cleared prior to the joining. Okay, in order to join the um, soft in that company you have to clear all the things before joining itself okay and the shortlisted students will have to go undergo six to nine months of training internship in person prior to their full uh, time joining post the selection the internship can be paid or unpaid basis the project requirement and role candidate should be open for both okay these are the note points in order to remember and the selection process and the exam processes see for this exam hcl tech for women 2025 batch the exam is at remote only you can give this exam at your home itself okay our friends gave this exam at home itself only and the complete assessment has six different parts you have to complete all six parts and the first part is verbal reasoning 15 questions for 18 minutes okay and there will be a webcam and there will be an um, voice recorder also and you have to be careful if you find any mal malpractices you will be kicked out of the exam okay part one is verbal reasoning we are going to see in my next videos we are going to see the questions which are asked in hcl tech right okay 15 questions 18 minutes and part two is logical reasoning 15 questions 18 minutes and part 3 is quantitative aptitude, 15 questions, 18 minutes. And part 4 is analytical reasoning, 15 questions, 18 minutes. And part 5 is critical reasoning, 15 questions, 18 minutes. Okay. Uh, be careful while uh, giving the answers for these questions because uh, 15 questions in, you have to answer in 18 minutes. So you should be thorough with the time. You have to manage the time. Okay. You are good with these parts, I think so, because there are six parts. You have to answer all those six parts in order to qualify the exam. Okay. There are, uh, you have seen part five. Okay. Now we are going to see the part six. Part six is the pseudo codes, 20 questions, 20 minutes. So, you know, coming to the pseudo codes, one question, one minute. Okay. C complete test duration is 110 minutes. Okay. 110 minutes is the complete duration six parts 110 uh, minutes okay thank you in order to know the complete details put it in comment section in my uh, following videos i'm going to uh, make videos on the direct questions which are asked in hcl tech okay i hope this video helps to you if you feel this video has informed me please hit a like so that it motivates me to do more and more videos for you thank you